Hey everyone, Cody here, and today I'm just going to go over the audio for this video because um, the audio actually cut out while I was recording. I didn't realize it until after I had recorded the video. So I'm just going to briefly talk about it. I'll speed the video up so it's not a long one um, and just kind of talk about what it was that I was trying to accomplish here. So um, I was actually trying to go for like an 80s look on the painting. Uh, that's why I've got, you know, kind of these bright colors, the bright pink and the bright yellow and the bright uh, blue and purple. And uh, it didn't actually kind of end up looking like that. It looks more like uh, an Easter painting <laughs> than anything else. So, uh, you know, I didn't realize it until it was probably like halfway done that that was kind of the look or the vibe that I was getting from it that it was more Easter than 80s and actually I, I tried to do a couple of abstract paintings with acrylic um, that were kind of 80s inspired because I saw somebody else do a painting like that that really kind of got me inspired about those colors and uh, I actually did three paintings I believe recorded all of them and they were all bad like they either ripped when I was kind of making them because they were all on paper uh, or the paint smeared or something like that and it just kind of it just ruined the whole videos and I was very frustrated with that uh, with with these paintings at that point uh, so I was like okay well forget it I will just go ahead and just make um, a gloss enamel painting because you know I know that I can make a lot of those and they turn out decent so that's why uh, you're seeing this painting is because I attempted to make an 80s inspired painting, um, but none of them turned out. So it ended up being uh, kind of an Easter <laughs> inspired painting in the end. And um, so that, that's why these colors are the way that they are. And I actually used this painting in a more recent video that you guys won't have seen at this point. Uh, trying to do like a texture trick to kind of give it some pop and a little bit of a, you know, like a 3D effect. So you'll see that video in the future with this same painting once it dried because I wasn't, I, I liked the painting. It was okay overall, but it was, it was kind of boring to look at. So uh, I reuse it in a later video, but that's pretty much it. Uh, I'm going to show you guys the close up and everything because the video is sped up, but I'll go ahead and leave it here. And yeah, that's it for the video. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care. God bless and see you then. Bye guys.